And right now, a push for employee vaccine requirements. Some elected leaders say private companies should require COVID shots for workers in an effort to boost vaccination rates. But so far here in Charlotte and Mecklenburg County, city and county workers don't face the same mandate. We just got a look at vaccine uptake and different government employees and the data might surprise you. WCNC Charlotte's Hunter Sign shares those numbers and the next step municipalities could take. Some of the city of Charlotte's frontline workers, those who asked for premium pay and also extra safety protocols to do their jobs, are the same ones who have the highest unvaccinated rate. For Mecklenburg County, their vaccination data for their workers isn't out yet, but something new will start for those workers next week. In a race to vaccinate, local municipalities aren't quite ready to force workers to get a shot. Incentives aren't even offered to Mecklenburg County employees yet. We don't know yet exactly what percentage of county employees are fully vaccinated. A survey is underway and starting next Tuesday, county workers who aren't yet vaccinated will have to be tested weekly. But the city of Charlotte does know how many of its workers are vaccinated. 95% of them filled out a survey showing only 62% of them already got the vaccine. You know, disappointed and and a little fearful, honestly. Mayor Pro Tem Julie Iselt is also frustrated by the results, showing frontline workers had the largest unvaccinated rates. 52% of Charlotte Fire Department is not vaccinated. 51% of CMPD hasn't got the shot. And 40% of CATS employees also not vaccinated. At the end of the day, we all have to do what we can as a functioning society to look out for each other. And vaccinations work. I still hope a minimum $250 incentive for city workers will work, but there could be other options, like having those unvaccinated pay a health premium. We've already paid out millions of dollars for health care for city workers who have had uh, the coronavirus, have had to be hospitalized. Um, you know, I mean, this is taxpayer money at the end of the day. The city of Charlotte first wants to see if these incentives will work before even thinking about implementing a vaccine mandate. Meanwhile, some Mecklenburg County workers already are under a vaccine mandate. Those workers who work in the public health department, they have until Tuesday to show proof of their vaccine or they could face disciplinary action. In Charlotte, Hunter Signs, WCNC Charlotte.